Hello and good morning. This is day six of the Food Basket Challenge. I am Jordan Bizdell, and while I'm right now I'm wearing glasses because my eyes are starting to hurt. I don't know why. That's just what they're doing to me right now. Anyways, my food is going bad. Um, in an attempt to save my food so it lasts throughout the week, my strawberries are are starting to mold and rot. Like as you can see, this is pretty disheartening. This is makes me really upset. I'm just gonna toss that over there. Yeah, and then not only that, I was gonna make a lot of sandwiches, but like just for the last two days, but it turns out that even these buns are starting to get moldy and whatnot. So, oh yeah, look at that one right there. Nice little green stuff, just oozing and growing. Yeah. Ugh. Also, I'd like to mention that I ate the turkey meat and I noticed something when I was looking at the package that there every 60, about 60 grams or so, there's nine grams of protein and there's about 180 grams in the whole package. Well, when you put that all together, that turns out to be just a little under 30 grams of protein. With me, I have that in the morning, like usually, or just at lunch, like I'll get a nice little scoop of protein, I'll mix it in, a nice little shake, and that'll be one meal. That'll be one meal. And I have to stretch that over several days, and that's my only source of protein. So that's... <laughs> Very upsetting as well. Also, I forgot to mention that last uh, last day, I actually weighed myself on a scale when I went to the gym, and I realized that I have actually lost six pounds in less than five days. Now, the thing about that is usually people are like, whoa, good for you, but no, that's actually not good because I'm actually getting soft around the edges, and it's my muscles are being, are deep, being eaten away, it's not a good thing to lose this much weight that quickly. So this whole diet has been a shock to my system physically and mentally and in some cases emotionally. Um, anyways, people have been asking some questions about why I spent five dollars on oil, olive oil of all things. Well. Just let me reiterate some things for you guys. I thought I was only allowed to spend $5 in total, and I didn't know that I was allowed to have some pantry items, and plus people were saying, like, olive oil is expensive. Well, where I went, olive oil was actually the cheapest thing I could get. Canola oil was actually more. So, if you're gonna be hating, just go on, throw on the hate, but that's, it is what it is. Also, the reason why I bought the oil, olive oil is because I wanted to eat, make eating the potatoes a lot more bearable. So, because I'm just not a fan. However, a friend of mine and myself were able to turn the potatoes into a nice potato bread, which I devoured because I'm getting hungry. And it was actually not bad. It was a nice mix of some flour, some like whole wheat and whatnot. So that was decent. But other than that, potatoes just aren't a fan. And because of the... And because of this, I've always been curious to try this. People tell me that a raw potato is not the best thing to eat in the world, but I'm just taking their word. Why not try it right now? I'm hungry, so I'll do anything. Mm. Okay, it has a bit of a kick to it. Oh, it tastes like earth, dirt, and oh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna cook this. I'm gonna bite the bullet. Oh.
Oh. Oh. Anyways. Uh, now the only question that is left is, what am I going to do with this? <sighs> Thank you very much for listening to me right now. This has been day six of the Food Basket Challenge. I'll see you next time on the last day. Thank you very much. Boom.